The title of our math lesson today is Kitchen Math. Isabel is making food for her friends to eat while watching the movie. She reads a recipe to learn how to make the food. Solve the problems. There were six people watching the movie. To be sure that there is enough pop and water to drink, Isabel is going to put four cans per person in the cooler. How many cans altogether can she put in the cooler? Are we multiplying or dividing? Yes, we are multiplying. There are six people that are going to watch the movie and Isabel wants to put four cans per person. So that's six times the four cans per person giving us 12, 16, or 24. Yes, 24. Six times four is 24. Let's move on. Isabel is making a nacho and cheese dish. The recipe for nachos include half a cup of onion. Circle the cup that shows one half. So this cup shows one cup. This cup shows one half cup. This cup shows one fourth cup. So we're looking for the cup that shows one half. Yes, B shows one half cup. Now, the recipe for nachos includes one cup of shredded cheese. Circle the cup that shows one cup. So this cup is one cup. This cup is half a cup. This cup is one fourth cup. So again, we want to circle the cup that shows one cup. Is it A, B, or C? Yes, it's A. Great job. Another ingredient for nachos is 16 ounce can of refried beans. Circle the can that shows 16 ounces. So here's a hint. OZ is short for ounces. Again, OZ is short for ounces. So this can says 8 OZ or 8 ounces. This can says 16 OZ or 16 ounces. This can says 17 OZ or 17 ounces. So which can do we circle that shows 16 ounces? Correct, B. That can of refried beans shows 16 ounces. So Isabel has several bags of nachos. She needs a 14 ounce bag for her recipe. Circle the bag that says 14 ounces. And remember a hint, OZ is short for ounces. So this is 16 OZ. This says 16 OZ. This says 14 OZ. We're looking for the bag that shows 14 ounces. Is it A, B, or C? Yes, C is a bag of nachos that is 14 ounces. Last question. One pound equals 16 ounces. Are 14 ounces greater than or less than one pound? So remember, we want the mouth to eat the bigger number. So if 16 equals one pound, we want to know is 14 ounces greater than or less than the one pound? So is it A or is it B? Yes, it's A. This one shows that 16 is greater than 14. 
That's all for today's math lesson. Make sure to do your exit ticket at the end.